Greetings and salutations. If you are new to the channel, I want to thank you for stopping by. My name is Eric Moss. I am a personal trainer, motivational speaker, and a modern day performing strongman. If you're unfamiliar with what a modern day performing strongman is, is I perform feats of strength like bending steel bars, breaking chains, rolling up frying pans, other things like that as part of a live show. And being a modern day performing strongman and the fact that I'm currently uh, currently a practicing performing strongman, at least when I can get a live event. Um, I know that people have questions about my training methods and stuff like that, and I come at it from a unique perspective. So I started a YouTube series where if you ask me a question in the comments, I will, and it's not something I had already answered, I will get back to you with your own, your very own customized video just for you. Pretty cool, right? So this question comes from, I have no idea how to pronounce his name. It is in look, Russian. He says, hi Eric, I'm training with kettlebell and do some isometric exercises with chain. When isometric training results will be noticeable. Sorry for my bad English, I'm a Russian. Well, no need to apologize for your bad English because well, I tried to look up how to say certain phrases in Russian so that I could respond to you, and I'm like, this, is, this just isn't gonna happen. So your English is way, way, way better than my Russian. So I wanna thank you for asking. Um, and I know that things are a bit of a mess over there, so I hope that you and your families are all safe over there. So. As for when you can notice a result from the isometric exercise, I would say it really depends on what kind of results that you're hoping to notice. Generally speaking, a, a training cycle within isometrics is gonna be anywhere from six to eight weeks. Um, the way I do it is I would take about six, to, well, six to eight weeks worth of sessions, uh, doing it twice a week in addition to the regular weight training. And the way I test for results is I will take a piece of steel or something that I had previously struggled with, um, something that I couldn't move, and see if I can move it. And if it moves, I know that I got stronger. Even if I can't finish it all the way, I know that if it's moving just a little bit, as they said in the movie Predator, if it bleeds, we can kill it. Now, if it's not specifically to bending steel and breaking chains and all that stuff, um, if it's if it's for weights, one of the other YouTube channels called No Limit Squad has a, a YouTube video where he retests his lifts to see if he gained any strength. And he was able to get it um, after 30 days where he said that his, his um, strength raised 60%. Now, specifically with the ISO chain is it has a measuring device to, to test for force output. So that was what he was retesting himself to see if he could raise it by 60% within that force output meter thing. Now, if that's gonna transfer to weights, I guess remains to be seen. But that should be, I mean, it really depends on, on the kind of result that you're looking for. So I hope that answers your question. Um, if, it, if it doesn't, please ask again in the comment section below. That, that also helps me get found by the algorithm. Um, and I truly hope that you guys are safe over there. So in the meantime, please stay happy, stay healthy, stay strong. Please stay safe, everyone, because I guess that's relevant once again. Um, but Eric Moss, over and out.